you guys okay so it is saturday 29th of october 2022 and it is currently 9 14. can you guys see i'm gonna run my first half marathon tomorrow this was like a last minute decision i literally signed up last night and it was more expensive because i did it last minute but it's okay kind of scared to do this it's like a very big decision for me i know for some people it might be like whatever but for me you know i've never done this in my life you know i run a lot you know i run every weekend up to like seven miles ten miles i didn't even really train for the half marathon i'm just kind of kind of gonna like just go for it basically doing this for fun i'm not like trying like to race or like i have like a time limit so i can you know get it out of my system every time i like want to do something and then i don't do it i end up regretting it i'm like i should have just done it like i should have you know so um yeah i'm gonna do it i picked up my number today here it is 494 hold up and then i got like these coupons so i'm excited to wake up like around 4 30 because um, my boyfriend's gonna come with me and support me which is pretty awesome i'm very happy that someone will be there for me i'm excited and like nervous at the same time and i feel like i'm gonna shit my pants i hope i hope that i don't need to poop while i'm running because that'll be the worst i should put this like on here on my leg i don't know if i can but yeah i'm gonna take you guys on this journey with me um, I'm gonna tell my boyfriend to record some clips and I'll try to record some like point of views for my for my phone like you know so we'll see what happens it's gonna be in downtown glad that I made this decision because it's gonna help me get out of my comfort zone and do things that I thought I would never do so it's like a huge thing for me and I'm like ah <sighs> I'm gonna do okay try to go to sleep i don't know i have trouble sleeping but i know i need to get some sleep so i'll update you guys in the morning and let's see how this goes hi right, guys so it's 4 70 a.m and i'm about to get ready I'm nervous um i think i'm gonna show myself yeah let's see how this goes so it's two hours and 42 minutes before the race um, I'm gonna change and then I'm gonna probably head out to my boyfriend's house to go pick him up Let me change real quick and then um, we'll be ready to go soon Hi guys, so um, I'm at my boyfriend's house. Um, I was about to leave already to head out, but he's gonna bring the electric bike to see if we can like try to ride it next to me. And then we're gonna bring like some 40 people stickers. You know what I noticed? So like, it's like Halloween weekend and there's like some people like barely getting home cause it's like 4 a.m. And there's some people who are like already waking up to start their day. That was like crazy to me. I was like, damn.
There you are. Go! That guy's in first. Long hair, green shirt. Yeah! You're gonna be coming up this road right here. All right, you're coming. <laughs> oh shit, there you go. Go, babe. You got this. Doing so good, look at all these people behind her. All these slow pokes. I want to go Look, I'm fucking walking as fast as they are. Damn, look at them go. Oh, they're racing. Lock bridge. Here comes first place. He doesn't need nothing. I would run half a marathon. I didn't even like running when I was younger. I hated it. And then as I got older, I started running and I ended up liking it. And then I just started running more miles. Like I'm more of a distance person. So I just went from there. And then one day I did 10 miles and I was like, I can do half a marathon. Like it's just like three more miles, right? And yeah, so I fucking did it. I feel like doing it and I feel like I would be able to do it so why not just do it right now instead of like waiting for like next year because who knows like what I'll be doing next year so I had the time and I was like let's just fucking do it so total time is two hours and five minutes with 55 seconds so it literally says 555 five, five. and then my total distance is 13.47 average pace 921 doing so good like i was running i was on my seventh mile and i was like it's only seven miles like i'm like basically halfway there so my first mile i actually did way better usually i run it in like eight minutes almost close to nine i ran it in seven 
minutes and 57. So that's pretty good. I mean, I did get a little bit slower. I was getting close to the finish. But once I saw the fucking the finish line, I started to zoom in. I was like, I did not stop at all. Like, I wanted to stop really bad because my I felt like my knee was going to lock. But then I, like, tried to, like, move it, and it felt good. So I just kept going. 12th mile, no, 11th mile, somewhere. Ending out waters and Gatorade. I was getting thirsty by then. Usually, I don't drink any water while running. I don't even eat. Like, I just fucking run, dude. Like, I don't know. I'm kind of getting thirsty. So I got a water. I stopped for a little bit. Walking after I finished my water, just for a little bit. And then I hear this guy, come on, you got it. You, um, We only have one more mile. And I was like fuck like i was just barely gonna walk for a little bit just to get like a little rest and i was like fuck well here's my cue and i just started fucking running again i did not stop again so i only stopped one time for a little bit and then yeah it was crazy it's crazy i never thought i would do this 7 a.m 13.11 here's all of that yeah let's see my heart rate was pretty good. Yeah, so I had to fucking do like a loop twice. It's freaking pretty good for a first time half marathon. Like, for the I end the video, I just wanted to say if you're ever like afraid to do something but you want to do it, just do it. Because what's worse that can happen, you know, <clears throat> that it doesn't go well? Well, at least you tried, you know? It's better than to just be like, damn, I should have just done it. Like, it could have actually been good or it could have been bad. Like, if it goes bad, you learn from it and you you can improve from it. I was afraid and then, like, I got the ticket, right? And then the day before, I was like, I woke up and I was like, oh, my God, I'm excited to run tomorrow. Like, I'm excited to see how it is. I'm excited to run through downtown. It was actually very nice. It was lovely. I was, like, wandering off. Like, I was, like, looking and running. And then just looking around at the buildings, like, oh, that's pretty. And everyone else was like, <laughs> like, they trained for this shit, dude. It's a really good experience, and I feel like I'm going to learn so much from it. See, the reason why I like running is because it helps me get things off my mind, and it helps me to push into things that I actually want in real life. Because, like, when you're running, like, sometimes you have to push yourself to keep going, right? So, like, whenever I'm, like, I want to do something, something creative, I'm like, fuck, I have to do it. Like, I just got to push myself to do it, you know? Just like how it is when running. But yeah. It's so lovely. It's, like, so big, dude. Like, it's literally... Like, a big size cookie.